right, everybody, welcome to this week's Railroad Crossing Tour video. Today we're back out here, more in uh, more local territory. We're done with the uh, Deschler videos, at least the ones I filmed. And we're back here at Romulus, Michigan. And today we're going to tour the Bibbin Street uh, crossing. This crossing sits at milepost 94.05 of CSX's Saginaw subdivision. And it's about maybe a tenth of a mile uh, from the uh, Diamond, where uh, the Norfolk Southern Detroit District crosses over. Well, <coughs> excuse me. If you're familiar with the area, then you, you know all that jazz already. We're going to start with uh, this signal right here. This signal sits on a double-sided safe train base, which is getting kind of covered by plants and growth right there. This has a uh, safe train gate mechanism, 2000s generation. And here's the emergency information for CSX, and the dot number of the crossing is 232187N. The lights on the signal are two pairs of safe train light heads, but what I believe to be Western Coal and Hayes LEDs shoved in them, second gen, and the dotted ones. I think that's right. They sit on a safe train light bracket. We have an NEG electronic bell and some Rico LED gate lights and no wind guard. Should have a uh, southbound train coming here soon. I went down to Wick Road where you can kind of see over that uh, hill down there. You can kind of see further and then there was a, a dark headlight or just a dimmed light. So I might be getting some here soon. Here's a look at the, uh, excuse me, the back of the signal. And we'll just do our track view here right now. This is looking uh, south. The uh, next crossing down there is Grant Street. And then after that is North Line. And if you keep going down the line, you'll eventually find yourself into Carlton, Monroe, and then Toledo. And this is looking north. The next crossing right there is Goddard Road. And this will eventually uh, get you into Plymouth, where a lot of the trains on this line take the turn at Plymouth to go on to the uh, Detroit subdivision to complete the rest of the way to Detroit. And then of course you also got the diamond over there and some signals guarding the diamond. And now we'll go on to this signal right here which is pretty much identical. This also has a double-sided safe train base, another safe train gate mechanism. Got two more pairs of the uh, Safe Tran light heads with the Western Coal and Hayes LEDs in them. Another Safe Tran light bracket. Another NEG electronic bell. And some more Rico LED gate lights. And no wind guard. But this one has a bent cross buck, I just noticed. And something else that I noticed right before that, right before I started doing this uh, tour is that CSX actually has the mains labeled right here. Main one right here and main two. I don't know if I've ever noticed that. I was just in Fostoria and Deschler, as some of you may know, but um, who knows? This could have been there this whole time. I noticed that in Fostoria, so who knows? I could have been there the whole time. Over here is the relay case of the crossing. There's Romulus's finest. And I think that's gonna do it here from, oh, hey, look at that. We got a headlight down there. So we'll see if that's, uh, if that's heaven for us or if that's just a TDSI job, but we'll find out. That's gonna do it here from Dibbin Street in Romulus, Michigan. And I'll see you guys in the next one.